I got one of the coolest smartwatches to show off today that's on the Amazon market. This is the Hamswan U Style smartwatch. Now, for what's in the box is your smartwatch, a micro USB charging cable, and your user manual that is printed in English and is easily readable, as you can see here. Now, some of the features of this watch are a TPU rubber watch band. Now, this thing is very flexible. It feels really nice to your skin. It feels really good. It has a nice little uh, velvety feel to it. It's really good. It's built nice and well, too. It doesn't feel like it's going to snap or break. The clasp right here is metal. Now, the uh, body of this watch is made out of stainless steel. So the entire back and the front, the top, are all stainless steel. So it's built really good. Doesn't feel like it's going to break. It has a nice quality feel to it. Now some of the features right here. Here is your speaker. And the speaker is actually quite loud. It sounds really good. That's on the left side of the watch. Now for the right side, over here we got your micro USB charging uh, port that's covered behind this plastic port right here. Here's a microphone right here. And here is your power button. Now the screen right below has a little U that is uh, a touchscreen back button. Okay, the screen itself is made out of glass. And the inner screen is uh, a 1.54 inch capacitive HD IPS panel with a 240 by 240 resolution. So it's actually really nice, sharp, and clear, as you can see here. It's, you can see this thing at really sharp angles because it's a nice IPS panel. Now let's talk about what this thing has inside of it. Um, it has a MTK uh, 6571 dual core processor uh, with speeds of up to 1.2 gigahertz, 512 megabytes of RAM, and 4 gigabytes of ROM. It's running Android 4.4. It has built-in Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 4.0, and GPS. So this is my home screen right here. As you can see, I set it up to be like this. As you can see, here's your main time right here. The date is right underneath it. And we have 88 degrees Fahrenheit, Honolulu, as you can see, as my city. So you can go ahead and choose this as one of your, uh, one of your main screen uh, features. We're gonna go ahead and slide in. The screen is capacitive, so just minimal touch, as you can see here. And it's moving. So let's go in real quick. I'm just going to turn down the brightness on my screen so that you guys can see things better. So if any of you are familiar with Android, this entire thing is Android, so... If you're familiar with Android, you're going to be able to easily uh, maneuver around this thing. Okay, so let's start off here. Let's start off at the beginning. So for your beginning apps inside of here, you got browser, downloads, clock, file manager, gallery, stopwatch, people, timer. This is a uh, Chinese app called DU, and that's a uh, GPS maps app. Here's your multimedia um, app right here, Bluetooth connection, and remote camera capture. That's a cool one. I'm going to show you guys that in a second. Here's phone. You can go ahead and dial. So you can send and receive calls. Here's your pedometer, compass. pretty cool sleep monitoring that tells you uh, how good of a night's sleep you got you can also find your phone right here just in case you walk away from your phone and leave it somewhere this is a really cool feature 
by hitting start. So I found my phone. There we go. We're good. Here's your weather app where you can punch in your city and it will tell you exactly how the weather is over there. There's your call history, notifications, settings, sound recorder, music, and schedule. Now this thing doesn't have a Google Play Store but there's ways to put it on here. But just like this, uh, it's meant to just be a tether for your phone. And uh, the app that it comes with is called USmart. It's built into the phone, uh, the watch, so all you got to do is send it straight over to your phone from the watch, download it, and once you have the USmart app, you can control some things on the watch directly from your phone. Here's another cool one right here. We're going to show you remote camera capture. This is a really cool app. Check that out. So wherever I turn my phone's camera, it'll show up on top of the watch. So you could actually uh, stand behind a wall and stick your phone out over the corner and just look at your watch and see what's going on, which is pretty cool. You can also take a, pic a snap picture right here. There we go, I just took a picture, as you can see. So that's really cool. That's a cool feature to have on here. Let's back out of there. So phone calls, yeah, you can go ahead and make a phone call if you wanted to. I can receive a phone call directly on the watch. There's some different watch faces too. Well, I'm going to show you guys the app, what it looks like. So here's the app. It's called USmart. Now, it shows you right here. You got your Wi-Fi. You can turn your Wi-Fi on and off. You can turn on your GPS location. You have a battery indicator at the top. You have notification settings find watch, I can also find my, the watch right off of, that's another cool thing. You can set your weather notifications directly off the app, and there's also file management and clocks, there's different clock faces, so whatever one I choose, like if I choose this one on here, it automatically shows up on the watch, that's really cool, as you can see there. Super cool feature to have. Now there's uh, other things on top of here like monitoring uh, for exercise and things like that. There's tracking. So you'd have to turn on your GPS. But yeah, the app's actually really cool and it works perfectly fine. Now we're actually gonna go inside of here. We're gonna go to the browser and we're gonna, let's go ahead and try Amazon. Let's head back out and I'm gonna actually darken my screen some more so it's easier to see. Head over to browser, click on Amazon. As, as you can see here, it's actually pretty fast. The dual core processor inside of here is really fast and it's nice and smooth. So there you have it. I highly recommend this watch. Um, go ahead and pick one up, guys. Thanks for watching.